Hello, I'm Dr. Charlene DeHaven, Clinical Director for Innovative Skin Care. Oxidative stress is simply damage to the body from free radicals. It disrupts the atomic structure within our cells. In every atom, electrons orbit around the nucleus. Free radicals are high energy atoms that contain an unpaired electron in their outer orbit, making them highly unstable. Free radicals gain stability by stealing an electron from the first substance they touch. This process reveals a new free radical every time an existing free radical becomes stable. Humans have both internal and external sources of free radical damage or oxidative stress. For the cells inside our body, about 85% of all oxidative stress comes from the creation of energy within those cells. But for skin, which is exposed to sunlight, about 85% of all free radical damage comes from the sun. The remaining 15% comes from toxins and pollution. The largest source of free radical damage to the skin is sunlight. The sun's rays are composed of packets of energy called photons. These photons are actually high energy free radicals that lead to extensive cellular damage. Sunlight is composed of several different types of ultraviolet rays. UVA and UVB rays impact skin the most. UVA rays penetrate the skin deeper than UVB rays. As a result, UVA rays deliver more free radicals to the body. Free radicals are highly unstable particles and will combine with anything they touch in order to fill out their outer electron orbital. This collision between atoms causes damage to the molecular structure of any substance, including cell membranes, DNA, and vital organelles. This damage can lead to cancer and cell death. The only way to combat free radical damage is to neutralize it with antioxidants. A variety of antioxidants is needed. This is because each antioxidant has different chemical properties. Antioxidants work to neutralize free radicals by donating an extra electron to stabilize their outer electron orbits. Thus, when they donate an electron to a free radical, the antioxidant still has enough electrons to remain stable. In this way, antioxidants stop the free radical cascade and save our bodies from the damaging effects of oxidative stress. Hydrophilic, or water-loving antioxidants, target the space between the cells and the cytoplasm inside the cell. Lipophilic, or fat-loving antioxidants, target the cell membrane and cellular structures, such as the nucleus and organelles. Because each antioxidant goes to a different place, a combination of antioxidants is necessary to achieve the most efficient free radical reduction. Our bodies do come with some internal antioxidant systems, but these, and even plus the foods we eat, are not enough to combat the amount of oxidative stress we experience daily and certainly over a lifetime. We need both hydrophilic antioxidants and lipophilic antioxidants. Topical antioxidants applied directly to the skin surface are needed. By treating free radical damage with antioxidants, we decrease the visible signs of aging and we improve the health of our patients.